Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Ghost eShop on your Nintendo 3DS or 2DS. It's supposed to be a new 2DS and it's, it has to be custom modded with Luma 3DS and the Homebrew Launcher. So today I'll be showing you guys how to do it. So first, you have to obviously take out your SD card. It's fine if it's like off or on, it doesn't really matter. You plug it in into your computer. Just takes a second for me to understand. So you have to go to the ghosteshop.com website. Then you just download the CIA file for it. And I'm just going to go over to my SD card. And I'm going to go down to the CIS folder. If you don't have a CIS folder, you can just create one. And then just save the Ghost eShop CIA file into it. It's just going to download, download almost immediately. Now we're gonna eject our SD card. Bro, it's fine. There you go. Now we're gonna place the SD card back into our new 2DS or 3DS system. Wait for all the apps to load back. Now we're gonna go over to the FBI application. We're gonna open FBI. We're gonna click on the SD, click A. And we're gonna go down to the CIA's folder. If you didn't have one and you already created it, click A to enter. Go down to the ghost eShop.ca file. We're gonna click A. And we're gonna go down and install and delete CIA. Or you can just click install CIA and it keeps the installation CIA on the SD card, but I need extra space. We're just gonna click install and delete CA and we're gonna click A. And then it's gonna ask us if we want to install and delete CA. We're just gonna click A. And it's gonna take like a few seconds. It, it has finished, it will show installation as completed. It's gonna, sh you can just click any button to go back. We're gonna click B two times. Then we're just gonna exit out of FBI. Click X to close. Then it says new software has been added to the home menu. We're gonna go over and unwrap it. There you go, you have Ghost eShop on. So it's just finished updating and this UI actually looks a lot similar, like the Universal Updater UI, like the store. I'm actually gonna try and download Geometry Dash just to look and see how it downloads. 33 megabyte Geometry Dash, confirm. Here, it'll show over here that it's downloading. I'm just gonna wait until this thing downloads. There you go, it just finished. It showed that um, Geometry Dash 3DS has just finished installing. I'll just see if it installed. Yeah, there you go, new software has been added to the home menu. Geometry Dash 3DS. So thank you guys for watching today's video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.